Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome back to another FGO monthly roll video. Today we are rolling on the Shootin' Doji Ibaraki Doji banner. So, let's see here. The main thing I'm looking for here is the Ibaraki Doji. I actually do not want Shootin' Doji because I have her already. MP2, don't, don't get me wrong, MP2 would be fantastic. But I have been looking to get an Ibaraki for almost a year now. So if the game would be so kind as to hook me up, I would be greatly appreciative of that. But yeah, it's funny. Uh, Ibaraki's like the only Oni between my two accounts I'm missing right now. And I remember around this time last year, we got the like SR select ticket. And I was so close to picking Ibaraki, but I ended up picking Pravati because that was around the time I had just gotten Scotty. And I think all I had at the time was like MP1 Adelante. And I recognized, I was like, hey, I'm gonna get Parvati's from the Kama banner in a couple months. But I was like, you know, it will probably only be a few Parvati's, you know? So, you know, getting one more isn't that big of a deal. It just made me get like MP3 or 4 or something like that. And then, you know, fast forward a few months, we do the Kama banner, and we get like MP16 Parvati, so. The ticket was basically wasted. Um, let's see, two more rolls here. I did, I was so frustrated. I, I was rolling on this banner earlier. Like, as you can see, I've been rolling a little bit. And I got a gold card spook. And I was so excited. I was like, here it is. I finally have a Ibaraki because I have neither. I think this was when the Berserker one was up. And it was a spook. It was a spook. I was so upset. Um, but looks like we didn't get anything here, unfortunately, so hopefully I get something from the rest of the event. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video, and I will see you again in the next one. Later.